So today I will be talking about the five benefits of not retwisting your hair. As I sit here and talk to you about the benefits of not twisting your hair, look at me with my curls. Contradiction? Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. It is your girl, Essence of a Shayskies. How y'all doing? How you living? How you feeling? If you haven't already, please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. At the end of this video, I will be announcing the winner of my 10K giveaway. Yes, I took forever to announce it. Low key, no high key. Middle key, I just was being lazy. But I do have the winner for that giveaway and I will be announcing it at the end of the video. So please don't forget to watch all the way through, like, comment, and subscribe. And let's get right into the video. So today I will be talking about the five benefits of not retwisting your hair. A whole bird just flew on my porch. That's a big bird, fam. Um, so... You guys know already that I, um, in the, the, the last couple years, I have taken like, I have taken to retwisting my hair probably like six times or four times a year and it benefited and not benefited my hair, but I saw tremendous more benefits. Um, and a lot of people always ask, like, is it okay not to retwist your hair? Like, wouldn't your hair fall out when it break and all this stuff? I mean, it just depends on your hair and the texture of your hair and how long you're going without, uh, retwisting. Um, a lot of people think because when you retwist your hair means you don't wash your hair. Lies. Wash on your hair. Don't do that. Reason number one for uh, benefits of not retwisting your hair is it, it alleviates the tension that you put on your roots when you twist your hair. It can leave your hair looking more thicker and more full, that full look that we're always going for. Because when you retwist your hair, unless you curl it like what I did just now, um, it has a tendency of looking flat. And that's another reason why people of the law community do curl their hair because they want that fullness but they don't want to sit around another couple months without retwisting their hair. So that's one reason as to why uh, retwi not retwisting your hair. It Number two, I feel like it helps you gain self-confidence and self-love because we have a tendency to think or people have implemented in our uh, membrane that only when your hair is retwisted, only when it is looking in the fresh, stage that's when you're most beautiful but if your hair you guys see me plenty of times coming up on this camera with my hair looking and i still was fleeky nobody was telling me nothing sis you feel what i'm saying so i feel like that goes a little deeper as to why that's a benefit for um, not retwisting your hair. But it is a really good benefit because it helps you with self-confidence. It helps you understand just to hone into your natural beauty, not worrying about all the extras to get that attention from whoever or to look at yourself and appreciate what you're looking at. Get it? The third reason and a reason that I stick with up to this day sweetie is it saves time and energy listen um so when i did this i started my hair at 1 30 in the afternoon i came out of the shower at 2 15 and then i started retwisting my hair at 2 30 i and i finished retwisting my hair at like retwisting and putting in the rods at like 4:45. Listen, that's my whole day, fam. And then I went under the dryer at like five and did like 30 minute intervals under that that dryer because it was hot. I was sweating in an AC apartment. It was hot. So at nine, ten o'clock, 
then the hair was fully dried then i was able to take it out listen my day is gone when is wash day and retwist day and style day all in one your day is gone sis you're not doing nothing else do you know how much you could be doing in that day look look at these muscles fam just just have a peek that is just from one day of washing retwisting styling taking out the curl them out of my hair one day and sure is Arnold Schwarzenegger. So I don't remember where I was, but I know I was speaking about saving time and energy um, when we're not retwisting your hair and giving your hair a break. It allows you to do other things and you don't have to worry about stressing yourself out or your whole day is committed to your one hair day. Like it's a lot, sis. It's a lot. Um, the fourth reason is it prevents buildup when you're retwisting your hair and um, all this stuff that adds product buildup to especially the roots so that's never good because sometimes we're not always washing all of that out we go inside the shower and we're just like listen um <laughs> I gotta get out like I don't have no time for this let's go and you probably left some you guys saw me the other day I don't think did I post that video yet but no there's a video that I'm posting of a retwist and when I put my hair down there was still like shampoo hair sis I was just over it like it's too much it's too much um, but yeah it prevents it prevents buildup in your locks so that's also a good thing when taking the time to just be like you know I'm just gonna give my hair like two three months before I retwist her, she'll be fine. Last but not least is something that makes complete common sense is if you retwist your hair too much, you could leave it thin and leave it to break. I know several people who have found their lock on their pillowcase and like I always make fun and say these things, but this has actually happened. Like people have actually found their locks just laying on their bedside. Uh, when they wake up in the morning is because you're doing too much to your hair. When I tell Una leave Una hair alone, y'all be like, Shay, I can't, 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 you're so funny, but I'm dead serious. Leave Una hair alone. Say it with me. Leave Una hair alone. You understand? If you guys enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, a comment, and subscribe. If I left anything out as to reasons or benefits why you should not retwist your hair as often or benefits as to why you should. What am I saying? Either way, leave it in the comment box below. Um, I love you guys so much for watching. The winner of the beats is... So not so much people um, entered the giveaway. So it makes it easy for myself, but I will be doing more giveaways. So enter y'all. So the winner is finding me after blog, um, D Carter. She followed the directions. So if you're watching this video, you are the winner. I will also announce it on social media. So please DM me so I can get your address and all that good stuff. And I will send you your beats. Okay. All right. See you later, Tiger Lilies. Toodles. Crash course. Let me have the money in the dashboard. Max mad, could you lost the brick inside the Porsche? Goofy with the curb.